morning, everybody. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I really do. And I'm sure a lot of, not everybody's having a great day today. Um, always learning. Always the student, never the master. That's the way I look at it. And you'll never be... You'll always be amazed and you'll never be disappointed because you'll always assume that, that you know, nothing's going to go perfectly in life. But you're going to keep trying, you're going to keep growing, you keep learning. And I have learned about power and how to use it and how to focus it and how to protect it. And, I, you know, how the universe and God works in all these little, in the collective, if you will, like the the symbiotic relationship we all have in the spiritual and not keep people can drain your energy there's it's not all negative but my energy can be drained by people that focus negatively on me and that is that has happened and it is happening but that but I'm also protected for the most part which is why I was having a hard time understanding why I was so tired and then I was brought <clears throat> excuse me and then it was brought to my attention why I was feeling so tired is one of the things that happens when you do shine bright as a light worker and you and you store up this positive energy I've been doing such a great job at protecting my energy that I am a powerhouse I have stored up so much positivity so much love in my heart and in my in my presence that, that the universe has tapped into my energy to help other people, to help the collective. Because there are those out there who are suffering and going through it hard. And they need that love. They need that light. They need that joy that I have in my heart. And so what has been happening is I have been getting drained by the universe. You know, it's like I didn't get a, I didn't get a text message. You know, a text, you know, an email or a text saying, you know, look, there's the universe. We're going to use you for a little bit. You're going to be sleepy. Just rest, relax, and, and just know that your energy is being used to help others, which I find is very, very enlightening. That's very, you know, heartening. Very, it's hard to explain it because I'm out here on my own, right? And I'm just talking to my phone and I'm hoping people watch these videos and they get inspired or something, you know, they feel something, right? But to know that my energy, my positivity, all this work that I've been doing to try to generate and protect my energy is going to be used to help others feel better is fucking awesome, straight up. I'm just like stoked when I found out about that. I was like, dude. So it's basically, I just got to chill. I'm like, you know, because I'm like, I don't know, I couldn't understand why I was so fucking tired all the time. I was like, this is not normal for me, right? But it's just, but it's the universe saying, just shut up, chill out, look where the fuck you're at. I'm at the, I mean, seriously, yeah. So what the universe is doing is the universe is telling me, look, you're my powerhouse. Just keep focusing on positivity, keep loving yourself, keep loving others, and keep generating. And we're going to tap in and use you, sucker. So just chill out and get some sleep. And that's what I've been doing. And I'm like... Fucking okay, nice. it's awesome. I mean, <clears throat> and I didn't realize that we're, you know, one of my favorite people, one of my readers, one of my counselors, one of my guides, who I have a soft crush on. I'm not, I don't want, I don't want to mention her name, but because it's her, her mother passed, and I can only imagine, you know, my relationship with my mother. God bless her. I do love my mother, but. She doesn't support or watch my channel, so I could talk some shit, and I'm not gonna get too much trouble for it. We don't have that kind of relationship. I have. I, I can only imagine the kind of. Her name is Emma. I'll give you that much. And the kind of. The relationship that she had with her mother and her grandmother was something I I can't imagine having that kind of connection with my mother. To, to be honest, and she lost somebody very important, special to her, very, very important she just passed and, and I'm hoping that my energy is being used to help her and make her feel better because that would be awesome because I do adore her and I'm you know she's part of my tribe and I hope she you know heals and knows that I'm there for her and everybody else is and we're all in this together and so uh, yeah but I'm gonna shine bright I'm gonna have a great day 
I might even do some painting. I'm trying, I was gonna go do some sales because it's gonna be sunny, but you know, like I said, I need to relax, I need to rest. The universe is tapping into my power station. I'm digging the shit out of it right now. Now that I know, I'm excited. I'm like, okay, this, cause I'm like, why am I doing this? Why am I protecting my energy? You know, is there like some big blast that I'm gonna help people? And if it's just me being a power station, being a powerful, you know, conduit that people can enjoy life and be happy and, you know, the universe and God can just tap into them and say, here's a little sunshine for you, right? I'm digging that. I think that's awesome. But anyway, that's it. I just thought that we're all power stations, apparently, and some of us are just really powerful. And if you feel drained, maybe it's the universe just using your awesomeness and your sunshine and to help others. Let's just hope that's the case, right? Because we need some sunshine, baby. Lord have mercy. Anyway, I love you, God loves you, and the universe is crazy about you, so have a wonderful day, okay? And I love you. I already said that. I'm a flirt. I don't care. Okay, bye.